Oh, Paimon longs to stretch her legs and run free in the world outside again! Oh, all right. Fly free, then. Basically, Paimon just wants out of here. Just a day? No, it feels like we've been down here for months! Uh, maybe not months, but at least like 20 days, surely! Yo, yo! Thought I heard you chatting over here. Oh, hey, Bullchucker. Well, everyone, I just completed another survey of the surrounding area. Still nothing has changed today. Here, have some water and take a rest. Thank you, Shinobu. <sighs> it's easy to forget to keep hydrated down here. Ugh, out! I want out! All I want is to cruise the streets and have beetle fights again. Boss, remember there's your image to consider. But it's so boring. Walking around this hole every day, I... If only I could slurp some ramen and see the beautiful flowers again. Ramen? Wait a minute. Speaking of ramen, Traveler, are you hungry? I'm not hungry either, but let me pose the question this way. Who is the biggest eater among us? It's definitely not me. Hey, what's everybody looking at me for? It's definitely not me. If anyone, it's this one right here. Huh? What are you looking at Paimon for? Paimon, are you hungry? Um, no. Paimon's not hungry. Why do you ask? Huh, <sighs> if that's the case... Huh? What, 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 what am I missing here? Yes, I heard that too as I was walking over. The question is, how can you not feel hungry even after 20 days? That's also strange. Of course, everyone has different perceptions of the passage of time, but how could one person feel like it's only been one day and someone else 20 days? Yeah, now that you mention it, I feel like we've been here three, four, five days, but I don't feel hungry or thirsty at all. Although I cooked some food, it wasn't because I was hungry. I just wanted to keep our spirits up. I was planning on saving our rations so we could survive a few more days but I haven't really felt hungry since. Now that I think about it, not only am I not hungry, but I don't feel any real signs of fatigue either. Whether I sleep or not doesn't seem to have any effect on how I feel. Yes, I concur. Resting doesn't make me feel more refreshed, and staying awake doesn't make me any more tired. Very peculiar. It's almost as if our physical state has been suspended. Aww, the more you say, the scarier it sounds. Paimon doesn't even want to think Huh? What's wrong, Traveler? Did you think of something? That's pretty weird. Sounds like the little dude must be in danger. But he is an Adeptus. This kind of situation should be no trouble for him. I fear that this problem underground is bigger than we thought. I found something, everyone. I just discovered a new path over there that seems to lead to an unknown area. You mean a way out? Oh, finally! Yay! You found something! Oh, please, please be the exit! I still suspect things can't be that simple. We should all stay prepared for whatever comes. Huh? Paimon doesn't see anything out of the ordinary here. Appearances can be deceiving. As I was examining the wall just now, I noticed there was something unusual about this stone. Seems to me that it's been created using some illusory magic. Hidden behind it lies a passageway. Whoa! So there really is a path behind here! Had to hand it to ya. That sure wasn't easy to find. But at least we can finally get out of here. Miss Yelon's determination and eye for detail are certainly impressive. Not to mention, you've hardly had any rest the whole time we've been trapped here. It doesn't matter. I'm not tired. <sighs> well, given we're already here, we might as well go in and explore. Right behind ya! Paimon can't wait to get out of this place!
Lucy, is that you? Hey, did anyone else just hear that voice? It sounded super creepy. Some sort of battle taking place here? I wonder who could be involved. Why would you become like this? I won't attack you! That sounds like Shu! Could he be in trouble? Whoa, sounds like someone forgot to invite us to the fight. Let's go and help him. Yeah, but how are we gonna find him?
quietly now. Hold the line! Gotcha! These are about to get sexy. to another platform! Let's go and take a look! <sighs> the ground... has... dissolved? What's down there? Is that little dude called Xiao down there? We gotta help him! Hold on. Something's not right here. What's this? It appears to be a small fissure. What can you possibly find inside? It can't be a living person, can it? <laughs> Conqueror of demons? Xiao, is that you? Uh, oh, I quit trying to scare us, okay? Huh? Wait, is this some kind of illusion? Paimon can't touch him! Conqueror of demons, can you hear us? Hello! Little dude! Anyone home? He isn't responding. What's going on here? You. Oh, he finally said something! Oh! We followed your voice and found you here, but it's kind of strange. We can't touch you. How did you become an illusion? <sighs> an illusion? Talk about a coincidence. We were just thinking you went missing and stuff, and then we heard the sound of you fighting. Pretty lucky we found you, if you ask me. <laughs> you didn't get hurt, did you? A coincidence? Wait. Something's not right. <coughs> Something's wrong with this domain. Leave now! Get out of there! If he can, we should have him regroup with us as soon as possible. Tell us what happened, and where you are now. We'll come find you immediately. No. Your safety is the top priority. It seems this space can... Huh? 
he disappeared. Where'd he go? It sounded like he might be injured. We need to go help him. It seems the only option we have to explore any further is through that entrance over there. Ha! Huh. He's injured and telling us to be careful? It's not like we're in any danger here. Anyway, the secret behind whatever's going on should be in this cave, right? Don't worry, little dude. Ito's on the way! Boss, please don't go charging ahead. You're an Oni, not some hunting dog. Don't worry! I'm invincible! Ah! Oh, my butt! <sighs> Looks pretty deep. Be careful, everyone. <laughs>